Um, so now it's done. It took about uh, four minutes, maybe less. Now to go back, you hit the power button, power button again, and you hit uh, reboot system now. You press it with the camera button, and it's going to reboot. So this is the first time I've ever done this. If it screws up, you're going to see it first time on camera. I tried looking for it on YouTube. I couldn't find it, so hopefully this is going to be the best, or this is going to be the first one. A couple of shout-outs to Droid Review. As I said, awesome videos, awesome tutorials. Watch his. I mean, this, this, per, this YouTuber, he goes through every single step. I mean, it's more than what I can do, and the way he teaches you is amazing. Um, to that... Uh, I've read this on Engadget about a couple of, like, 15 minutes ago. Uh, Droid Life, or Droid, one of those. There's a forum, which I showed you. You could download it. So, yeah. It's had the Motorola logo for a long time. Hopefully it hasn't crashed. I hope not. Nope, it's doing something. It's destroyed. Okay, so it's the uh, it's the normal bootloader or um, splash screen, whatever that's called. So guys, um, this doesn't have Wi-Fi enabled just because of some uh, protective something. But uh, I mean, if you have this, you have 3G. So and Verizon 3G is amazing. Anyways. So, first boot up always takes a long time, as if you guys have known, if you've installed custom ROMs before. So, don't be worried. It's boring. So, Froyo has, a, it has Flash, it has tons of cool stuff. It has uh, speed acceleration, hardware acceleration. I mean, that's a, that's a very nice ROM. It has the uh, different launcher it has a couple of home screens nothing new to uh the people who mod your droid i mean you, you can easily get seven eight home screens um one one other thing if you're going to um do this you might as well just uh, buy a uh, set cpu it costs about a dollar and you can uh on the droid, you can you can over uh, overclock it to, uh, I think 1.1 is the maximum, but I might be wrong. So that's very nice. Except obviously that drains your battery life, and it makes your phone quite hot. All right, guys. Um, this is taking forever, so I'm just gonna stop this video right here. Go do something else. Return. Maybe it should be fine. If not, then. I'll probably have to redo it. Alright guys, I'll see you in a few minutes. Alright guys, I'm back. Um, so when I... Where's this going? What's it called? When I came back up here, it was turned off. I turned it back on. I mean, it was sleeping. It came to the uh, a little welcome screen, and you just have to configure your account. You sign into your Gmail account. That's exactly what I did. And... Hopefully this doesn't take forever, because I don't feel like... This is boring, takes forever. I don't know why. Probably because it's a... Uh, probably because I don't have any 3G. So, I'm gonna move this to a window. Alright guys, after uh, waiting for a long time for it to recover, um, I mean, restart and do all of its stuff, finally got a 2.2, and to prove that it is, you have the custom launcher, you have the, there's the new um, live wallpaper running in the background, and so like those colorful lines, you just have the red ones. So you go into settings, you go into about the phone, Going to see if I have any system updates or not. Let me see. 
Uh, so here we see, I'm going to zoom it in. Android version 2.2. .2. There it is. Let's see. Uh, because it has Flash, First Sight, I don't think Hulu's going to work on there. But let's just see uh, Flash.com. So, uh, <coughs> I apologize, I have a cold. Um, what was I going to say? Who's not going to work? There's a couple other sites. Uh, I think that's, I don't know why, Hulu has some kind of something up that it doesn't work with a lot of Flash-enabled phones. So, this should, the reason it's going so it's kind of slow is because I'm running on 3G. As I mentioned, uh, Wi-Fi is not enabled, so, yeah, but, I mean, you get for real, you get 2.2, .2, you get 2.2 .2 before Verizon releases it, so, and then when they release it, you could just, you just do, like, a, like, a restore or something, or you could wait until one of the, uh, the, um, modders actually implement that, it's taking forever, Multitouch doesn't work on this because it's a mobile, mobile um, website. Other, other than that, Multitouch works. Yeah, this is very painful trying to uh, watch it. I would just recommend you trying to skip to the other. Not skip to another video, just skip, skip throughout like the timeline. All right, so something's happening. Okay, that is not working, so I am going to stop it and let's see. Let's see anything new. The uh, Nexus One style launcher comes with a bunch of preloaded apps. Comes with the um, new ones are Twitter. I haven't seen Twitter on there, and that's basically it. Amazon MP3. The dialer, normal. I actually don't like it. I actually like the, uh, the, uh, I don't know if anyone's seen the Ultima Droid dial dialer. That's amazing. So that's it. That's the first look. Um, yep. So just comment, rate, subscribe. I'll have all the links in the, uh, in that little bar, wherever it is somewhere all right guys uh hope you liked it see you later